Now I'm going to show you how we do a little detailing. I've got some uh, Duplicolor. Get out of there, you little bastard. I'm going to uh, take this gold and I'm going to go inside here. Remember, this has got three or four good coats of clear on it that have not been touched. Our goal is to take the gold scratch and fix, and this I believe is lacquer used for touch up on, on cars. And I'm going to go inside all of these areas and I, what I want to do is I want to get all the depressed areas. Now I know that with my unsteady hands and everything I am going to get some overlap on the top here a little bit. Now that's okay because this is what we've done. This is what the plan is. I put uh, four coats of clear on there. When I put the gold on there if it overlaps at all, no problem, because I will take some thousand grit sandpaper on the overlap and go over it very lightly. And all I will do is take down the top layer of clear, which this paint will be on, and then all of this uh, Honda will show in very, very bright detail. All right. After I get done with that, then I will continue to apply clear to, to this whole panel. And you'll see it, it'll look really nice, but that's how I do it in reverse a relief uh, or base relief. I believe it's base relief. So this comes with a, a neat little, there's a pin on one end, right here, that's paint. And on the other end, if I can get it out here, it has a kind of a, uh, a nail polish thing like that. See, it's a little tiny paintbrush. But you got to be real careful because the more that you paint like this, the more of it runs from the top all the way down to the tip. And you could be doing some fine finish work and get a big blob on the end there. So you want to put in a little at a time. If you have to do the job two or three times, it doesn't matter. Our goal is to fill, not to, not to fill up these areas, but to paint all of the base relief, the bottom areas, and more importantly, the edges on the sides underneath this clear, the edges. So we get a very strong Honda uh, in gold look. And that'll look really nice as a um, complement to the rest of the job. So I'm going to go and, and put a coat on and see what I can do. And remember, I'm, I'm 50 years old and I don't have the uh, reflexes I did as a kid. And when I was a kid, I could make time stand still. I was the last guy at dodgeball. I was the guy that could not catch a football. I could, my reflexes were like an absolute mongoose going after a cobra. I could make time to stand still, I was so fast. But those days are over. So now I just have to go slower and practice. And remember, practice makes perfect. If you have a good teacher like me, and I believe in all of you out there, if you want to, if you want to paint, just take your time, follow my steps, ask me questions, and I'll, I'll answer them. I've already put spot putty on these areas, which I told you about. I'm going to let that dry overnight. Then I'll shoot more black on there. And we continue.